Hey guys, um, Joe here. So yesterday I experienced definitely the most scary thing that's ever happened to me in the gym. I was going for a bench press one rep max. I'm gonna show you the clip now and then please stay afterwards to kind of like hear what led up to it, what happened and stuff for full context. But yeah, this video is just to kind of show like the bench press isn't just a joke. It, it can be very dangerous. Yeah, here's the clip. I also just looked back at the video and I noticed that when the fail is going on, I'm like, I'm screaming. Believe me, I'm never, I'm not the type of guy to ever really shout or scream. Just in this one occasion, I was really scared. You could hear it in the tone of my voice as I was screaming. It was kind of like a shock and a natural like instinct response, which I did that, but here's the clip. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh! 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 Don't! No! Get it! Get it! Hey guys, so it's been several hours since the incident and I kind of just want to explain like what happened. I tried to film this explanation like 20 minutes after the incident, but I just was not in a good state of mind. Stuttering my words, just it wasn't great. So here we are. I know a lot of you are going to be like, oh, Joe, you're being so overdramatic. Nothing bad happened. Uh, let me just kind of explain the situation. You can make your judgment off it. Everything that happened here was my fault completely. I take full responsibility for it and it was stupid of me. But yeah, let's go from the beginning. So I was going for a bench press PR a one rep max. I just completed 80 kg and then I bumped the weight up to 90 kg, which for me is a personal best. I know 90 kg, my bench sucks, I get it. <laughs> anyway, for this bench press one rep max, you may be saying to yourself, Joe, why don't you bench inside of the power rack? You know, so then you've got the safety pins if you can't lift the weight up and I completely get that, that you should do that. But my power rack sucks basically and you can't bench inside of there because it's too small and this cable mechanism gets in the way. So as you saw in the video, I bench outside of the rack. But obviously because this is 90 kg, it's a one rep max for me. I don't know if I'm gonna get it. I need a spot, but the only spot in the house is my little brother Tom, who has no training experience, no spotting experience, and he's a pretty young guy, which I take full responsibility here, and it was so stupid of me. I asked my little brother to spot me, and because he's a really nice kid, he says, yeah. We get into the gym, and I say to Tom what I say to every spotter who spots me. I say, don't touch the bar unless I say so. Don't touch it unless I say it. Yeah. Yeah. Just. Tom says yeah uh, and then we get onto the bench it's 90 kilos I bring it down and then I push it up and as I'm pushing it up I feel good you know when you're pushing the weight up and it's going slow but you know that you've got it that was this situation it was going slow but I knew I had the weight now obviously because Tom has no spotting experience he thought I wasn't getting the weight up he thought it was stuck there so he puts his hand on the bar and starts pulling up a little bit then in the heat of the moment I say no 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 because Tom was like touch the bar without me saying for him to touch the bar like I said earlier so Tom was kind of like in this confusion of well does he bring the bar back up like he was doing or does he just let go because I've said no and he let goes so now I'm in this position and I know that I'm not getting the weight up after this so 90 kilos just stuck there I'm trying to hold it and I can't and it's coming down the weight so what I try and do is I try and push it back onto the like the, the little metal clips as you can see, the metal clips were too high up. So when I push it back, I just push it onto a wall of the power rack. And at this point, there is nothing stopping the bar with 90 kilos on with my skull. So I'm now in this awkward position where the bar is not in a good position for benching. It's too heavy for me as it is, and I can't hold it. So the bar slams down onto my skull. Uh, that's 90 kilos, which is pretty heavy, uh, slams my skull. And Tomble doesn't know what to do here again because he's never spotted. So he doesn't pick up the bar straight away. So at this point, there's 90 kilos just crushing into my skull and I can't do anything about it. I, I in, in the moment, I, there was nothing I could do. So I shout Tom to help me and eventually he does. But at that point, it had been like two or three seconds of 90 kilos just crushing into my skull. And I want to speak about like when, when I was in that position, completely helpless, I didn't know what to do. I was scared i can't even lie i didn't know what damage i'd done to myself anyway eventually tumble picks up the bar uh, and i kind of shoot up uh, because i know that tumble can't fully bring it up this part here where the bar's kind of like crushed into bleeding everywhere blood is dripping all around the place i want to blow out the blood because of like youtube guidelines and i also don't think you guys want to just see blood on a towel. Anyway, yeah, then Tomble, an absolute legend, helps me out, gets me like patched up kind of. But I'm going to be honest, straight after the situation, I was in, I was a, 
a little bit like in shock and a bit like trauma traumatized. I know it sounds pretty petty, but I didn't know like this is my my brain area. I didn't know what I'd done to myself. But yeah, it wasn't it, it wasn't a, a great time for me. So yeah, I kind of wanted to make this video for one to show you guys how much of a melt I am, and two, it's kind of like a don't do what I did type video. If you are going for a one rep max, especially in the bench press, which is a very dangerous exercise, make sure you're in a suitable environment. For example, you have like clips and safety racks, or you have a spotter who knows what he's doing kind of. Tomble, if you're watching this video, you, you did nothing wrong whatsoever. C completely my fault, I put my hands up for this. And you know what, to make me look like even more of a fool, here's a funny confirmation of this failed bench press. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up.